salute, 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 man. It's your boy, uh, Stony Rock Store in the building, man. You already know. So today we're going to talk about, you know what I'm saying? When you slip, you get your throat cut, man. You know what I'm saying? You can't be sleeping on the gate. You can't be thinking that you home. This is prison. Yo, it takes place in Sing Sing, man. You know what I'm saying? When shit was real ruthless and crazy and it, Deuce was getting it in. That ass, like, Deuce was getting cut every day. Like, Sing Sing is like a baby rackers island, bro. Like, Sing Sing is like, like, still being on the islands, like, close to New York. Deuce is coming on. Violations and shit. They sending all the violators to motherfucking B block. Shit is just, is popping. It's going down. So you got this kid. Know what I'm saying? He must have not really been in tune with, like, the shit that goes on. And, you know what I'm saying? He talking a lot of shit in the box. And he think that, you know what I'm saying? Like, dudes can't get, get to him. Now, dudes got a tendency, right? To do a lot of running their mouth when they're in the box that they wouldn't do if y'all was in population. Like, a lot of dudes... You know what I'm saying? As soon as they get behind that gate, as soon as they feel safe and dudes can't get to them and that gate is locked and it's separating your dudes tend to get a little slick out of the mouth. You feel me? Like real quick. Like it's this it's this <laughs> it's fucking crazy because a lot of dudes they just ain't real. They don't know how to be real. You know what I'm saying? It seems as though being real takes um you know, time and skill or something that you got to go through for your mind and click and say, all right, I'm not doing these things no more. I'm experienced, et cetera, and so on. But a lot of dudes, man, just be fake, phony, and fraudulent, and they don't be keeping it official. So if they don't keep it official, then they going to get dealt with. So we on the company, you know what I'm saying? Everybody g mac and us already know what time it is. Only dudes that, you know, be extra, extra action acting extra hard and shit you know what i'm saying like you don't have to walk all crazy and shit like if a dude see you in prison you walking extra tough and shit like that they know that you scared bro you know what i'm saying only scared dudes do shit like that it's like an animal trying to keep other animals off of them and shit like that like when the snake strikes up like this he only trying to show that he got more size to the other animals and shit like that than he really have. Or when other animals raise up or do shit like a badger, you know what I'm saying? Like all type of animals got defense mechanisms to try to make themselves look bigger than what they are and shit like that or more tough. So basically when you walk around tough like that, you're only fronting and portraying an image trying to be something that you're not. Real motherfuckers move nice and easy and regular and cool. Fake motherfuckers that be scared, they expose their hand to dudes that's experienced and can read body language and see that you just faking the jack and you scared to death up in here. You trying to act tough. So this dude, he running his mouth, he trying to act tough. He come down to the box, you know what I'm saying? Dude's already going to pop his motherfucking head off. Ah, ah, ah. So he talking mad shit to old boy. You know what I mean? Now, old boy, he already got mad time in. You feel me? So he like, all right, man. You talking all that shit behind the gate. We going to see, nigga. Ah, ah. When I catch you, I'm going to pop your fucking head off. So this nigga, he keep running his mouth. You know what I mean? And acting like he in the hotel, like he in the brip, like he home, like ain't nothing going to happen to him. You feel me? So then it comes time for shower day. It comes down shower day. You know what I'm saying? Dudes come out of their cells and shit. They walk over and they see this motherfucker sleep on the motherfucking gate. You know what I'm saying? With his head on the motherfucking gate. In the motherfucking cell balls. After talking all that motherfucking hot shit. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Know what I'm saying? You motherfucking amateur. You fucking clown. Know what I'm saying? Get the fuck out of here. So, son just kindly, politely, ever so gently graced this motherfucking shit through the balls 
while the nigga was sleeping and cut his motherfucking throat. Know what I'm saying? And this nigga woke up, know what I'm saying, trying to scream, but he could hardly get a fucking pitch out. Only thing he could do was bang on the motherfucking bed to get the CO's motherfucking attention and try to get some type of shit out because the nigga didn't cut through his larynx because he didn't have the sharpest motherfucking weapon in the kitchen drawer. You feel me? A lot of weapons and shit get made is... You know, they're pretty sharp, but they's not as sharp as some shit that you probably would have in the town. So, son had to shank. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't the sharpest thing in the drawer. Feel me? But it still cut this motherfucking nigga's throat. And this nigga had to get like 80 fucking stitches on his shit. Cut that nigga pretty much from his motherfucking ear to ear. Blazed his shit up. You know what I'm saying? So, hopefully, that stupid motherfucker learned the lesson from that. You know what I'm saying? And life goes on, me. You know what I'm saying? So the more real story is, man, just be real. Be your motherfucking self, man. If you ever have to go to jail, man, all that walking tough, niggas gonna see through that. They gonna expose you. Don't be motherfucking a tough motherfucker when you get in the fucking box behind the fucking cell and think that you safe, cause real niggas with experience know how to get at you. So it's your boy, Stony Rockstore. Salute, Eastside.